Welcome to the ResNet Account Setup Tutorial. This tutorial will take you through the steps and procedures for setting up your account in the ResNet Agent Portal. You should have a copy of your real estate license, a W-9, a tax ID number, an Arrows and Emissions Certificate of Insurance, your photograph, and your company logo. So we will start off with the basics and you will enter your brokerage company name under your broker. If you are the broker, you can keep the report to broker blank. If you're an agent, put the broker's agent ID that you report to. Your title again. If you're the broker owner, that would go here. Then your broker license. This is where you input your license information if you are an agent and the information should be who the license is issued to. And this is where you're going to actually upload a copy of your license. So we're going to go ahead and put the license number in. We're going to select broker or agent, expiration date, generally a year away. Then we're going to place the address from the license inside the control panel here. the issuing state and then we're going to go ahead and locate a PDF of the actual license and we're going to go ahead and double click on that and you'll see that it is now on file. Then go ahead and add your office address. Now we're going to put in your contact information. Both phone numbers office and mobile are required. This will make sure that whenever you fill out forms, contact information inside of any transaction, this information will automatically port over so that your interested parties can contact you. The last thing that you're going to do are add your tax ID number. Again, this can be a social security number or an EIN depending on what type of business entity you operate under. You would then upload a W-9. For our purposes, we're just going to click on Agent License again. You can upload any PDF or document there. The next area you will fill out is your Errors and Omissions Insurance Coverage. You will see there is the ability to upload an actual Certificate of Insurance or PDF as well. And the last section is Setting Up Your Account Settings. You'll add your name, your last name. You'll add your email address, your username, and your password. Next, let's set up your territory. In territory, what you'll do is choose your state. Your zip codes will automatically default on. Then you can choose county, and then you can choose specific areas in the county, and you're allowed up to 200 zip codes in the system. These zip codes are used for prospects and clients that are searching for agents. Next, add your resume. Again, this is an upload of a PDF of your resume on file for people in the business who are looking for an agent. You can also see your photo is there and your logo. There are also places for adding certification And you can also add references, a maximum of three, and these are professional references that you can fill out. The last section is your agent bio, where you're free to make comments about what your specialization is or how many deals you've closed. This is where you get to put information on your account that shows your specializations and skills. Your clients, buyers, and sellers coming from ResNet's buyer, homeowner, REO, and short sale portals can see this information when selecting who they want to work with. So make sure you express what you want to about yourself. Add an assistant to your account. This will allow you to add an assistant by their name into the account as well as their email address and allow you to assign tasks to them throughout the life of every transaction you manage. Once the assistant is added into the system, you will be able to send them email notifications and passwords. 
The last thing you'll be able to do is actually go ahead and let them have access to editing certain things inside your account. So the last thing we will do is create your e-signature. You'll type in your name as you want it to appear on documents and you will e-sign in the system. Then go ahead and save the complete profile and your account is set up.